Welcome back. We're back in Colorado, but this time we're going to Smoky Breckenridge. <laughs> Apparently, National News doesn't tell us there's fires. So we will see what adventures happen to us and if we can evade the fires and have fun at the same time. Check you later. <laughs> well, before we go fishing, Indy's got up, Indy fly fishes, so we're at Orvis right now and we gotta pick up some flies. So that's what we're doing right now. Let's go say hi to Indy, see what he's chosen. Let me see what you got. Are there? Huh? What do you mean? What do you mean, real? Is that real plant material? No. No? No. This is amazing. A sex dungeon. What's a sex dungeon? Yep. As y'all can see, it's a beautiful house. It looks like Lincoln Logs. I mean, it's just beautiful. But before we get into our little daily adventure today, I got three pretty cool things I'm gonna show you. Or three, three pretty cool things I already found. So first, the first thing is, we got a hot tub. There's some random kid in the hot tub right now. I have no idea who he is. Okay, we'll kick him out later. But second of all, a little bit scary, but also kind of, you know, a little bit, a little bit intriguing. I found some bear poop on the ground. I will show y'all a picture in a second, but, it was pretty big, about the size of my head, so hopefully find a bear later. And last, but certainly not least, we have our own private subway system in the mountains. It's called the gondola. Um, all you gotta do is literally walk 10 steps out of the house, and you can go up the mountain, down the mountain, left, right, wherever you want. And yeah, so that's what we're gonna be doing today, and I'm gonna bring y'all along with me. And there's another random kid right there, but we don't know him, and I will get back to y'all later. Fish on, fish on, fish on. Get it, get it. Oh. What? Keep going. He'll get, he'll get himself out. Oh, like I'm under. Don't lose him, bro. Bro, he came off because his f is right here, bro. But he's not off, Indy. He's not off. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Bring it over here, bring it over here. Step down, step down. I need you to reel, reel that in, reel that in. Real fast, 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 fast. Teamwork, motherfucker. Oh, all right, all right stop, 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 stop. Let's go, let's go. Get him, bro. Yes, sir. It's a nice size. He's okay. right there. I'm fucking drag is not. Excuse my language. Watch your language. <laughs> Bring him over here. Let's get this shot. I'll grab the fish. Get this. Where is he? Come here, buddy. Well, I'm changing up baits right now. I was working with a spinner tail or whatever it's called, rooster tail. Wasn't working out very well. Um, Andy's been using his fire rod as, as y'all seen. He caught that one fish. So I'm gonna change up 
to uh, some power bait. And in Texas, honestly, power bait's the best thing you can use. But I don't know about Colorado, so we're gonna try it out. There's trout everywhere. You can see them. You can put the lure or bait literally in front of them and they just won't eat it. So I'm not gonna give up. We're gonna keep trying and let's get a fish. Let's go, there we go. Ooh, little jump action right there. Let me get it. Yeah. I'm gonna sweep. That's a fish. Thanks, bro. Thank you, G. Look at that. Another nice fish of the day, Andy. You got him? Yeah, you want to picture it? Yeah. If I can, it just might be too shallow. We got to save some people from this storm. Stranded on an island. 